watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Shout out to Blue Blood Sports TV. Y'all watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Shout out to Blue Blood Sports TV. You're watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Hola, habla Cindy. Está viendo Deportes TV. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV. Back at y'all with another one. So, Khabib has turned down the man known as Money, Floyd Money Mayweather, $100 million offer to face off in Saudi Arabia. Uh, Khabib has said that he's focusing on his uh, April 18 fight, uh, and that's all he's focusing on. He's not interested in facing uh, Floyd Mayweather in a boxing match in Saudi Arabia. His team said that they've been in contact with Floyd Mayweather and Floyd Mayweather's team. They've been in contact with um, uh, 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 promotional companies. They've been in contact with uh, um, bankers and things of that nature over in Saudi Arabia. And they're not interested. They want to stage. They said that Floyd Mayweather uh, wants to stage a boxing match uh, with Khabib. And um, Khabib is not interested. He said he's not moved by the money. He's moved by his legacy. He has a huge fight coming up April 18th, and that's what he's focused on. He also stated that they were offered uh, a deal, a $100 million deal, to face um, uh, uh, Conor McGregor as well. But Khabib said that he's just not interested. So Khabib has turned down, and I know, you know, Floyd Mayweather is not used to, you know, uh, guys turning down that type of money. He used to getting what he wants. You know, uh, when you uh, dangle that kind of money in front of um, fighters, that's not making, I'm sure Khabib is not making that amount of money. So usually Floyd Mayweather is used to, you know, guys jumping, chomping at the bit and jumping at the bit, right? Uh, Khabib has a fight in uh, uh, April 18th, like I stated, which is a huge fight against Tony Ferguson. Uh, and it's in Brooklyn. So, you know, he said that's what he's focused on. You know, um, some uh, investors and things of that nature have uh, reached out to his team. Uh, he said, I know some people in Saudi Arabia. They met with me. They wanted to pay me $100 million, uh, to fight Floyd Mayweather in a boxing match. And they also offered me to face uh, Conor McGregor in Saudi Arabia for $100 million. But I have no interest. I'm focused on my April 13th fight against Tony Ferguson. That's all I'm focusing on. Uh, so, you know... Um, Listen, Floyd Mayweather wants to make a comeback. He wants to, you know, uh, 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 make uh, tons of money as he's used to making, you know, but he needs the correct dancing partners in a crossover match. You know, he did so with uh, Conor McGregor that made him, you know, about $200 million. You know, uh, to, to do a rematch with Conor McGregor is not going to tally up the same amount of money. It's not going to, um, the revenue is not going to be the same because it's been there, done that, right? We know what to expect. But if you throw in a different name from the USC, like Khabib, you know, uh, it'll, it'll uh, um, lower the casual fans and the UFC fans into believing that Khabib has an uh, opportunity and a, and a better chance to defeat Floyd Mayweather to be successful. Uh, he's younger. Floyd Mayweather is obviously older now since the Conor McGregor fight. We haven't seen him in the ring. So, you know, um, you know they'll, they'll show interest in it. Uh, they'll bank and they'll bet on Khabib and they'll believe that he has an opportunity to beat Floyd Mayweather, which I totally disagree. It doesn't matter if Floyd Mayweather is 46 years old. When it's in the boxing ring, you know, uh, Khabib, Conor McGregor, they're out of their element, and they really don't stand much of a chance to beat Floyd Mayweather in the squared circle. Now, if it's in the octagon, uh, absolutely, they have a huge uh, chance. And, you know, they will be favored, right? They probably won't even last that long. Because they're, they're, they're much bigger than Floyd Mayweather. So, you know, with that said, uh, Floyd Mayweather is looking for the correct dancing partner to come back to make the uh, amount of money that he wants to make. I believe that he wants to have a crossover fight with Khabib and uh, Conor McGregor or Conor McGregor. Uh, and then he wants to have that rematch with Manny Pacquiao. You know, two fights like he stated in 2020 to make big money. But he needs the correct dancing partner. And uh, unfortunately for Floyd Mayweather, he's not uh, able to secure that, that, that opponent. Another thing is, if Khabib is to face um, uh, Conor McGregor and defeat Conor McGregor and still doesn't accept Floyd Mayweather's offer, that really puts Floyd Mayweather in a bad uh, spot because then uh, Conor McGregor would have suffered another loss to Khabib, so people really wouldn't have too much interest in Conor McGregor and Floyd Mayweather in a rematch. So Floyd Mayweather is in a, a bad spot. He's backed up against a, a wall. 
and uh, he, he's willing to overpay. I'm pretty sure that number, that $100 million number, is going to uh, uh, grow for Khabib as long as he stay on his ground and stay on his square because they're going to get desperate and they're going to offer him even bigger amounts of money to stage the fight. So let's see how this all plays out. Floyd Mayweather said he's definitely coming back in 2020 and uh, he wants that crossover match and the Manny Pacquiao match. Now I can see Floyd Mayweather going into the Manny Pacquiao fight first and then going into the um, uh, uh, crossover match with Khabib or Conor McGregor or UFC star. But the problem with that is um, Floyd Mayweather would much rather have, you know, the UFC fight as a tune-up because that's a way for him just to get back in the, uh, the swing of things. It's like a tune-up fight, you know, so that's that would be perfect before going into a fight with Floyd Mayweather. I mean, with Manny Pacquiao, excuse me, who's a true boxer and is still active. So let's see how this all plays out. But uh, that's all I got for y'all. Y'all already know what it is. It's your boy, Blue, Blue Blood Sports TV. Hey, like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the bell icon to get all the new notifications. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV, all one word. Y'all already know what it is. Shouts out to the entire LDVC. Shouts out to new media. Shouts out to Black Media Row. Make sure you like and share these videos. That's all I got for y'all. Peace. Hey, this is Jasmine. Thank you for watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Hola, soy Jasmine. Gracias por ver Sangre Azul Deportes TV. Gracias.